Hey guys, welcome to Riva Academy. In this tutorial, we are going to look at progress bar in Flutter. And if you really like this video, please share it with your friends who are also learning Flutter. So we started by creating a new project in Visual Studio by the name Progress Bar Demo. With, uh, we will save this project. Okay, so this will open up. This has created the default counter application. I will remove these extra comments from the main class. Okay, and I will remove these two extra classes. Cool. And I will create a new class by the same name, my home page, so that we can start with a clean slate. Okay, class my home page. And I will remove this title parameter from here. Not required for now. Cool. And instead of container, this will return scaffold. And we will add the app bar. And we will add the title. Title text. Say. Progress bar demo. Cool. Now let us run this in emulator. Okay. So as you can see, this is nicely running in emulator. Now we'll start by adding some progress bar to it. And to do that, we will add this body. And over here, we will add a column so that we can place progress bar one below another. Okay. So we will add a circular progress indicator. Okay, but before that we need to add children. Okay, so now, now we will add a circular progress indicator. It is very easy in Flutter to add a uh, progress bar. We just need to write this circular progress indicator. Right, save and hot reload. You can see this progress bar. Okay, so let us align this properly. Let us add some padding. So we'll wrap this column inside the padding. Okay, save and hot reload. You can see some padding is added. And let us also bring this to the center. Okay, so we'll wrap it with a center widget. Save and hot reload. Okay, you can see now this progress bar is displaying very nicely. And in Flutter, we just need to add circular progress indicator. Okay, I made a padding to 20 so now it's displaying nicely okay circular progress indicator we need to add only circular progress indicator to, to display the progress bar now let us play around with it, some properties i will add one more circular progress indicator and i will change the color okay i will add the background color and say colors dot uh, i will add red color Okay, so this blue color is of the theme color, right? Whatever the default app theme it is there. So it will take one color from the app theme and one color from the uh, the color which we have specified. Okay, these are overlapping each other. So I will add a size box between. Okay, size box height, say 10. Cool. Cool. So you can see these are the two types of pro uh, progress bar we have displayed. One with uh, two colors and one with the single color. Okay, so now I will copy one more circular progress indicator. I will add one more. Okay, and let me also copy this size box. Otherwise, they will overlap each other. Okay, cool. Now what I will do is change the height and width. So we will wrap this with a size box widget. Okay, we can wrap this circular progress indicator inside the size box widget to change its height and width. Now we can give the custom height and width to our circular progress indicator. Okay, I will give height say 50 and width also say 50. Save and hot reload. Okay, you can see the size is increased of this particular progress indicator. Right now, let us make some more big. Okay, let us do 150, 150. Okay, save and hot reload. 
ओके नाउ दिस इज़ वेरी यूज ओके सो यू गॉट द आइडिया ऑफ हाउ वी कैन इंक्रीज द हाइट एंड विथ बाई रैपिंग इट इन द साइज बॉक्स विच इट ओके दिस इज वेरी यूज लेट मी मेक स्मॉलर ओके आई विल डू हंड्रेड हंड्रेड ओके गुड राइट नाउ वॉट वी विल डू नेक्स्ट ओके इन फ्लटर देर आर देर इज वन मोर टाइप ऑफ प्रोग्रेस इंडिकेटर एंड दैट इज अ लीनियर प्रोग्रेस इंडिकेटर सो लेट इज एट दैट ओके लीनियर प्रोग्रेस इंडिकेटर ओके वी जस्ट हैव टू राइट दैट एंड यू कैन सी दिस प्रोग्रेस बार इज बींग डिस्प्लेड लेट मी एट दिस साइज साइज बॉक्स विज इट ओके सेव ओके You can see there is this linear uh, linear progress indicator as well. Okay, and similarly we can also change the color in linear progress indicator the way we did in uh, the way we did for circular one. Okay, now let me copy one more. Seven hot. Okay. okay and to this one we will uh, change the color okay so you can play around the properties and it is super easy to include them in your application okay so you just have to write background color okay seven hot reload you can see this green color the steel color and blue color has been displayed okay so uh, i th this was pretty much it for this video i hope you like this video and if you really like this video please share it with your friends who are also learning flutter thank you so much for watching